Good evening everyone and welcome to Ellen Parish Church Worship at Home. Uh, this is Tuesday night, it's lovely to be with you. Um, we've started a new um, series in uh, the sermon series in church on Sunday mornings called 66 words um, and those are the 66 words of the Lord's Prayer um, and that's what we're going to be looking at over the next wee while so I thought we'd tie in with that um, today as that seems to have been quite helpful for folks when we tie together the, the Tuesdays and the Sundays. Um, so on Sunday we were thinking about uh, the first part of the Lord's Prayer, um, our Father in heaven, uh, hallowed be your name, and thinking a bit about his name um, and about um, God being, uh, being holy, uh, being the first, being overall, um, and uh, kind of worshipping him as that, but um, recognising that, um, that, the, that the, the world is broken, that God's name isn't um, revered and seen as holy by a lot of folks um, and that it's it's our job and our, our hope to um, restore that and that so much of what God has done is to restore our relationship with him. So we're going to go on a wee journey tonight um, uh, with our songs. I'm going to read a little bit. Ali was telling us about how um, the Lord's Prayer is broken up uh, kind of into two parts. One that's about who God is and loving God and then another, the other part about um, how we treat each other um, and that the commandments are, are broken up with that too. And um, so we'll read that bit tonight. And then we're gonna do two songs. Um, the first one about um, uh, the Holy Holy God Almighty by Brenton Brown. Um, so just kind of in our own hearts, putting God uh, back into that place. Um, where maybe he's been kind of crowded out today um, and uh, so just kind of doing that and then we're going to do the rising that thinks about um, when things are broken that, um, that Jesus uh, is the rising that Jesus is the one who um, picks us up and puts it back together and the, the healing work that he does um, and then instead of a spoken prayer at the end um, we're just going to sing a, a version of the Lord's Prayer so we'll read, we'll sing, we'll pray, um, and uh, hopefully this will be a, a helpful time for you, um, for us all tonight as we worship God. So let's read. Um, from uh, Matthew uh, chapter 22, and um, just a couple of verses from verse 34. It says this, when the Pharisees heard that he, Jesus, had silenced the Sadducees, um, those who'd been questioning him, they gathered together and one of them, a lawyer, asked him a question to test him. Teacher, which commandment in the law is the greatest? He said to him, you shall love the Lord your God with all your heart, with all your soul and with all your mind. This is the greatest and first commandment. And the second is like it. You shall love your neighbour as yourself. On these two commandments hang all the law and the prophets. Let's pray together. God, thank you that you make it pretty simple for us. To love you and to love each other. That when we're not sure what to do, that... Um, all of your teachings, that your life uh, here, that your story with us, that they hang on these two things, that you love us and uh, that you ask us to love you in return and to love each other, to see each other as you see, as you see them, to see ourselves as you see us and to act accordingly. Thank you for the opportunities we've had to love our neighbours this week and help us to see the opportunities in the days to come. Thank you for this time together where we can come and say, God, you are holy. You are, uh, you are the first. You are the all. You are our God. 
Thank you that you uh, come and dwell with us tonight, tonight and now. As we spend time with you, that you are spending time with us. Thank you for that gift. In Jesus' name, Amen. Oh
One of the things that um, we hope this, uh, that Ali was saying, hope this series will help us to do is to think about the Lord's Prayer um, in more deeply. And so hopefully in presenting it in different ways, um, that'll help. So uh, that's why we're going to sing it tonight instead of say it. Let's pray together. Thank mm-hmm. you.